Hi there, in this short video I'll be demonstrating a new feature in version 7 of the Perceptive APC real-time software, and that's the ability to add a background image to a dashboard. Now you can use background images for all sorts of visualisation tasks, but I find it really handy for creating a mimic of the process. We can get started by selecting a new blank dashboard. This is done from the visualisation ribbon. All dashboards initially appear in edit mode, so all we need to do is right click and select background image and we can select our image to add. You can see that I've chosen a nice image of two activated sludge lanes and I can overlay this with any other dashboard element such as dials, faceplates, trends or indicators. In this case, I'm just going to add some signal indicators for process values. And we do this simply by clicking and dragging the signal of interest onto the dashboard panel and selecting indicator from the dialog. Note that if you need more precision in the placement of your indicators, you can change the size of the placement grid at any time by selecting edit grid. Once we have placed our indicator, we can switch to display mode to configure the indicator. This is done by clicking in the top of the dashboard and selecting mode and display. Indicators are highly configurable and you can change your indicator color in response to different signal values. But in this case, I'm just going to set the indicator text and color. And we do this by right clicking on the indicator and selecting properties and then we'll expand the dialog out and entering a value into this indicator state region. Now the text we'll enter here is dollar signal descriptor dollar signal value dollar signal units and then lastly we'll set the color to a nice cheerful green color and apply that so you can see that the resulting indicator text and value has been pulled through directly from the signal configuration the last thing we'll do just to make it look nicer is we'll increase the size of the text so that it's more visible. So we'll make that 18 point font in bold. And there we've got our indicator set up. Once you have created an indicator, it's a very simple matter to apply the same configuration to the remaining indicators, which gives us the basis of our process mimic. And once we've saved the dashboard, it can be viewed either natively in the software or via the integrated web browser, or via embedded using HTML5 frames. For more information about Perceptive Engineering, please visit us at www.perceptiveapc.com or follow us on Twitter at PerceptiveAPC.